Hi everyone. In order to get started using your Office 365 account, the first thing you're going to need to do is to gather your username and password. And this is generally sent to you by email and it will give you a temporary password along with the login username that you're going to use from now on to use your Office 365 account. Right now I'm on the home page of Office 365. You see up here in my web browser it says login.microsoftonline.com. That's the URL for the site. Once you go to it, you might want to bookmark it to make it easier to go to. I generally don't remember the URL, so I often go over here to Google and just type in Office 365 login, and it's usually the first one listed in the Google search area. So to get started, if you've never logged into Office 365 before, you're going to put in your username, and for our school district, it's going to be generally your regular username at lindbrookschools.org. Okay, it doesn't match your regular email address for school, so just pay attention to that. And then you can copy the temporary password from your email, or you can type it directly in this box. And then you're going to be prompted to change your password. So I copied mine, and I'm going to paste it. If this is a computer that is my personal computer, I often tend to check this off so that it remembers my username and I don't have to type it over and over again. And then I click sign in. So you can see because this is a brand new account, this person, Tim Tebow, has not set up his own password. He is going to be prompted to change it and to set his own password. So you're going to paste in or type in the old password that you were given, that temporary password from the email and then you're going to create your own password. They do have a particular criteria. If you look up here, it has to have at least eight characters in it. So I'm going to type in one that I use with other accounts. And it says it's strong, so we're gonna go with that. So once we click Submit, this is the home page that it's going to bring you to. If there was a problem, you didn't match your passwords, it'll prompt you to do all of that again. And right now, this is as far as you need to go. Once you see this screen, you're going to know that you successfully logged into your Office 365 account. You can make note of your new password because that's going to be your password for the remainder of the time you have this account. If at some point you do happen to forget your password, you will need to contact one of us in order that we can reset it. There is no forgot password link on here. We have to manually reset it for you. So in the next video, we're going to start playing around with some of the applications that you see here and really get into the nitty gritty of Office 365. So get excited.